New Power Party legislator Huang Guotang has survived a recall vote to remove him from office after the motion failed to attract the sufficient quota of yes votes. The vote in favor of recalling one of the former Sunflower Movement leaders failed to reach the required threshold of one quarter of Huang's constituents. Meanwhile, ru ruling DPP politicians quashed rumors that they saw Huang as a threat to their support base in New Taipei City. I responded yesterday to all kinds of questions. I humbly accept the outcome and will continue with my hard work. Having survived a recall attempt, legislator Huang Guo Chang gave a low key response to journalist questions. The results of the vote were announced yesterday with over 48,000 voting in favour of recalling Huang and over 21,000 against. But as the number of yes votes failed to pass a required threshold of a quarter of Huang's constituents, the recall motion ultimately failed. There was speculation that if the recall vote had been successful, Huang would have seized the opportunity to run as a mayoral candidate in New Taipei City, and the ruling DPP feared Huang and his NPP would have snatched votes from their support base. I think this is a far cry from what actually happened. People are over-imagining things with this theory. As none of this has happened, I feel I don't need to respond to these questions right now. The DPP Secretary General has also made it very clear. The DPP has no room for compromises with other parties when it comes to its deployments of mayoral candidates. Now that Huang has survived a recall vote, the question is whether the NPP will still vie for a mayoral seat. This would have a decided impact on the DPP's plans for its own mayoral candidates.